Hello, David. We're starting the wheelchair training today. Yeah. Um, thanks for coming in. Thank the first thing you need to know is to switch the wheelchair on. This button is to turn the wheelchair on. Great. Great. When all of the lights are lit up, you're at top speed, you're indoors, you need to take it back to, with the tortoise, to half speed or just under. Because for indoors, you need to be at two miles an hour. Right, David, you're ready to drive, so just start forward. To the edge of the mat, great. Now we have the pedestrian light. Right. We have to pretend that there is traffic passing across the zebra crossing, right. and you need to keep an eye to see what's coming and what's going. Right. I am going to turn the light so that it will go to green, to the green man, at which point you need to check the road, right, left, right again, L look and listen, right. and proceed across if it's clear as quickly as you can. Okay. Good. In order to be safe inside buildings, it's necessary to take a center line in the corridor in a powered wheelchair so that people exiting doors or coming around corners and people pushing trolleys do not collide with you. So we're going to proceed down the middle of the corridor now. Stop there. David, when we are outdoors, mm -hmm. you can take your speed up to four miles an hour. So yeah. you just press the hair there and take it to full speed. That's four miles an hour. It's a fast walking speed. Okay. And that's what you want when you're outdoors. outdoors. Now, David, we're going to proceed into the parking lot. Yeah. Safe to do so. Observe the parking lot, mm -hmm. nothing moving. You can go towards the drive and head out near the center towards the, the main road. Just go to the middle here, David. Yeah. And stop. Now, we're going to observe the road. If nothing's coming, you cross directly across, not at the diagonal, right. straight across because it's the quickest route to the other side where you will be safe. When we proceed along the road, David, make sure you stay out of the channel for the water yeah. and any hazards like the drain cover or rough right. okay. broken bits of tarmac because otherwise your wheels might catch and okay. place you at risk. David, proceed and turn the corner to the left Right. Be aware that there's a drain cover there as well. Stick as close to the pavement as you can. Yeah, just avoid it. David, I want you right. to slow down here and stop and reverse into this space here because we're going to cross oh. the road. Great, you're in a good position now to observe the road. Now I want you to look again to see there's nothing coming and cross directly over to the dropped curb over there. Now turn left and I want you to stop on the slope here, David. Right. Stop there. Now David, if you take your hand off the control there, right. you will find that the chair stops because it has an electronic brake and you will not roll backwards on a slope. There's a slight click. Yeah and it kicks in. That's great. The control release has allowed the electronic brake click in. Did you hear that? Yeah. Good. That means that the chair will not roll backwards because your electronic brakes are on now. Right. So if you have to stop on a slope, you're always safe. You can proceed along the pavement now all the way to the end. Oh.
when pedestrians are approaching you, right. please can you slow down or even stop because right. you never know which side of you they're going to try and walk okay. and you don't want to run into them. David, we're approaching a junction now. Right. We have the lines. Yeah. Where you need to place yourself is in the middle of the road alongside the central right. line right. and okay. at, at the junction. Yeah. The reason for this is that you need to be visible at all times to a driver who's approaching behind you. Right. If you're at the side of the road at a junction, unfortunately, because you're at a low level, yeah. they won't be able to see you. Right. So make sure that you're in the middle of the road where they can see you. Yeah. Okay. All right, yeah. we'll proceed now right. along the white line and to the junction. Okay. Is that okay? Yeah. Okay. That's good.